Looney Farm Guy here, and this is Three Sided Farm Pack by Bernie SCS on Farming Simulator 22. It's for all platforms, PC, Mac, and console. I'm on PS5 here on the Rock Crawl map for this uh, test and demonstration of this pack of, well, buildings. And we have a shed, <coughs> a silo, a house, a, a factory of a sort. And a cow barn. So lots to look at here. 33.4 megabytes to download. Slot counts vary from uh, 10 to 7 slots. I did forget to check the slot count on this cow barn. Uh, but um, it can't be more than, uh, well, I'd say 15 or so. We, we, might, we might try it later. But anyways, um, everything looks really good. So let's start let's start at the beginning shall we now if we go way over oh let's go way over here and start with the shed and so this is going to be found under buildings and sheds and there it is fifteen thousand dollars and only seven slots on console so you know it's not slot heavy it looks pretty good it's got that old um old farmyard type pack looking or yeah anyways uh let's get in we have doors that open once you get inside here l3 will turn the lights on so very nice pretty simple there you don't have to search for i kind of like that you don't have to search for switches now either uh i mean either you have a nice big like marker on the floor saying hey the light is here or just have it like this press l3 when you get inside and there's the light so turns the lights on in here too you can turn them on or off very nice and we have this little door that kind of scoots right in between the the buildings and we have this now there there's an upper area up there which um we don't have access to so um Maybe if you had telehandler, you could store some bales up there or something. I'm not sure. Maybe some pallets. But there's no stairs up there or anything like that. If we run around the other side, no access up there either. So, pretty nice. Uh, on to the next. This is going to be found in silos. And we'll go into silos. There it is, 250 pieces, bales and pallets, bales and pallets. No alternate colors or anything like that. None of them have. So uh, bales go in here. When they go inside, they appear here, but um, they're there, but not there. Very nice. You still have the rest of it uh, open. And again, turn on the lights like those. So this one does have access up here. So you can store things up here if you like. And there's, I believe, the, as you put more bales in, they'll, they'll go up into the second level. But here is, then let's see, let's take them out. Where do they, oh, they appear over here. That's interesting. So these are liftable, of course, but if, uh, if you have non-liftable ones, uh, expect uh, them to appear over here. Go in here, come out over here. So uh, that's kind of different. That's neat. But there's lots of room in here, so it's not like you're cramped or anything. It's drive through. So if you have an auto load bale trailer, um, you can easily pick those up coming through. Now, the next one is house. There's a farmhouse and buildings and farmhouses. There we go. $50,000. 10 slots for this one. <clears throat> Uh, very similar design to the rest. Very nice. It would go together. You'd make a whole farmyard with this, of course, as a pack. Here is the wardrobe. That is my future self when I get skinny and um, not so good as looking as I am now. Anyways, uh, sleep trigger. Just kidding. Uh, there you go. So the next one, what is this? This is something very interesting. We've seen something like this. Uh, before but we haven't seen a silo for a while that does all these things so first where do we find it productions 
and factories. <clears throat> there it is, $15,000. Production silage. So we have four input materials and one output. The output is silage. That is nine slots on console and no alternate colors or anything like that. Product goes in here, product comes out here. Um, it has quite the capacity, two million liter capacity. I didn't put any of the other ones in there. The recipe is all the same. So what we want to do is turn that on and we're going to see how fast it actually produces product. Uh, information is pretty sketchy on the mod description. Um, it actually didn't have a cow barn listed. It had shed L form and shed and farm silo listed amongst the farmhouse storage and fermenting silos. So yeah. Um, I do believe I got all five pieces. That's all I could find. So while that's running, we have the cow barn. The cow barn is under animals and cows. There it is, $80,000. I forgot to check the slot count on it. I don't think it's going to be much compared to uh, if you look at the other. The other ones were pretty low. 80 cows. We have, let's see, there we go. <clears throat> so... Straw is 21,375 liters and the total food capacity is 33,750. For 80 cows, it's, it might be a bit touch and go. Bales accepted here. Straw, as you can see, is uh, interestingly spread about once it's filled and the food appears here. Now we have um, the animal dialogue here, 80 cows inside. I believe this is the milk and oh yes there we go that door opens uh the milk output we're going to put down a manure what manure would fit right there so i've heard some comments saying oh you put it down a silo you should have put down an extension um that may have been true in the past um i gonna put down a manure heap if it doesn't collect with a manure heap, I'll put down a manure silo or extension and see if that works. But I've uh, from the first update of this game, I think they fixed that little goofiness there. Uh, slurry output here. We have several doors that open. We kind of have a... Um, well, a garage part to this barn so that's night nice. again l3 lights on and off uh believe yeah anywhere inside here cows have a really nice area to graze outside for visual and uh, you know humanitarian reasons and there we go so now what we're going to do is we're going to kill two birds with one stone or um one rock perhaps <clears throat> and um we're going to go a month ahead see how our farm silo uh, silage factory produces and then we're going to see how our cows fare uh, with a month um, in a month with the food and straw they have all right so here we go and so let's let's check out the fermenting silo first shall we and oh just i just can't help myself yes we have manure so that's all good that and that yes that is the manure silo from the silo manure silo silo from the silos so it does work um so let's take a peek here oh 115,000 liters so let's go take a look at the the uh, production chain so the capacity is massive um in going um the production speed is meh meh not terribly slow but not terribly fast either which is okay, just as long as you know that. I, you could probably tell that by the cycles per month. And we're right at that right there. 120 cycles a month, 1,000 in, 1,000 out. Just add some zeros to the end of that. 120,000 liters. So, but I had to check. Um, right, so there is that.
Now, how about our poor little cows? Uh, well, I say poor little cows. Manure, they have pumped out a fair bit of manure, so they must be doing well. Let's take a look at our animals, shall we? There it is. So, productivity, good. They have not run out of food. It's close, but it's good. Uh, straw, plenty of straw capacity. Milk and slurry uh, have been produced. We can see they're about a quarter to a third of the way full. So you can kind of guess at the capacity for that. Probably two or three months at the most. Right, so let's um, let's grab a, a bale of straw and I'll show you where the food and straw go in. Both in the same place. You can put loose straw in as well if you like. But here is the straw going in. There we go. It is full again. We didn't even take an entire bale of straw. Right, so let's... Uh, I should have prepared this earlier but um, it's good to go I always have re I always have everything ready to go for the most part and so we're gonna check out our milk trigger and yes the milk trigger works just fine we'll swing around back and we'll check out the uh, or actually it's on the side here yes right over here whoops and there's our slurry trigger. Yes, it works just fine. And as you can see, manure is collected. And there you go. So a nice pack. They all nice, uh, they all work, which is good. And uh, it all looks good. So, and it works fine. So we have a nice small uh, capacity. Well, you can say small, 80 cows is quite a bit actually. If you ever seen a bunch of cows, 80 cows, milk and cows especially, and uh, everything works as it should and looks pretty nice altogether. That's the three-sided farm pack by Bernie SES on Farming Simulator 22. Thank you all for watching. And remember, it's only a game. So till the next one, bye for now.